So welcome back to Valone's RC Hobby. And in this video, we're on Zoom this time instead of Skype. I think the Zoom <laughs> setup's a little bit better. And uh, I got some special guests with me and they're halfway around the world. It's Joe and Amber from the RC Kiwis. And I came across their channel basically watching my own videos and other videos on YouTube. Um, they kept coming up on the decide, you know, recommended video section. So I had to reach out to them because me myself like i've been trying to get my wife involved mm -hmm. with rcs and she just gives me like that look so i'm happy to introduce joe and amber from the rc kiwis guys how are you good, uh, doing good. really doing good, very good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now they are in hong kong right now mm -hmm. is that right that's right man oh my god so do you you guys live in hong kong or is it just business we well, are. we live in New. We're from New Zealand, and we've lived in New Zealand our whole lives. But in 2018, we moved out here because for my job. Wow. And so for the last just over two years now, I've been living yeah. in Hong Kong. It's not too bad. It's all right. There's a lot of hobby stores. Yeah, a lot of hobby stores. <laughs> very cool. <laughs> you, hot summers. Very hot summers. <laughs> very hot. So, if you don't mind me asking, what kind of what line of work are you in? Because I know many times the, the RC stuff is just a hobby. But if you're, uh, you know, if yeah, you the on the RC. It's not a full time job. Um, <laughs> right. I actually am a pilot with Cathay Pacific. So that's why I came over here to fly for them. This is a, the base for Cathay is Hong Kong, the main base. Wow. And so we fly, we fly out of here and we go all around the world normally, but because of the pandemic, of course, we don't really haven't been flying much at all. Okay. But, um, I mean, we were in New, New York like a year or two years ago. Almost. Right? Almost. Oh, was it 2019? Yeah, we, almost went, we went all the way over there and I had a short layover. It was like 24 hours, super short. But Amber <laughs> and my brother came for that one day in New York, but it was so much fun. We did a lot. So much oh. fun. We did a lot. It was, was freezing too. Small amount of time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's got, it's gotten scary here because no one's going to the city anymore. Really? I mean, well, and there's been riots and there's been fires yeah. and all this since this thing started. Uh, wow. And it was an election year, so that had a lot to do with it here. Mm -hmm. But yeah, yeah, New York has been like no one's the, the the shows are closed down, sites are closed down. It's like become a ghost town. It's sad. Yeah. It's really sad. It's really crazy thinking of Times Square empty. Yeah. Yeah. When we were really there, crazy. when we were there, it was it was pretty busy, eh? Yeah. And yeah, we, we got a, we got a what do they call it? A Lamborghini ride through a le a Lamborghini, through <laughs> one of the bicycle rides. That's what the guy was calling it anyway. <laughs> no kid, no. Well, that's why we got RCs. I mean, to escape from all this stuff that's going on right now, and yeah. uh, that's part of what what I love about it as well. You know, like we can go outside and be on our own and just race around with some RCs and not have to worry about what's going on. You just kind of let whatever's going on behind you, and. Um, yeah, I just, I, I say it all the time. I just, I love feeling like a kid again and not having to worry about, <laughs> shut my phone <laughs> off and yeah. Exactly. You know? So, but how long have you guys been in RC? Well, for me, I've always been into that kind of stuff since I was a little kid. Like I, I was into model planes and model boats and mm. model cars. And then it was RC cars. <laughs> and then I went to RC boats, RC oh. yacht, and then to an RC plane, which didn't last long. <laughs> and then to RC cars again. Wow. And then I went back to planes like a year or two ago and then lost those two. Or one I lost into in the middle of a lake. Uh, we went up just behind our apartment. There's this nice, beautiful lake. And I was flying this, um, it's like a Cessna around, you know, it's flying around. And I crashed. I sort of ran out of battery over the lake. Oh, no into kidding. The lake. So I was go about to go for a swim. And as I went to the water's edge, there's this massive king cobra, just like a meter from me. No Enormous, kidding. massive black king cobra. And I was like, you know what? Forget about that Goodbye, plane. plane. Never wow. seen again. And then so we went to cars. And yeah. then that's that's where we started at the beginning of this year. Yeah, yeah. Almost yeah, you, you, I'm, I'm right around you guys. I think I'm I started my channel six days after you. Oh wow. So yeah. So January's coming up on my year as well. So yeah. Um pretty interesting. You know, I I've been on YouTube for probably almost about 14 years with my other wow. channel my wow. bw yeah, channel yeah we saw your other channel yeah and i you know it's um i started back when it was a lot different yeah so when mm -hmm. i when i started again with this channel the valon uh, rc channel it was like different world i mean oh, just yeah. different way to set up and different way to mm -hmm. market yourself so but it can uh, be challenging know. eh? there's a lot of competition a lot a of lot rc of channels millions a yep 
go of them. and it's like <laughs> how do you get seen i think it's every one second there's 500 hours of content posted throughout youtube and it's like how do you get your 10 minute video seen by people i know it yeah, it's it's, it's really tough you know it's 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 a wide niche you know a yeah. niche and uh yeah there's, there's a lot of people out there doing i, I mean I, I, like you said there's probably thousands of channels i mean oh yeah. yeah we it's, find them all every day like yeah finding new ones and big ones big too ones, big yeah. youtube channels pop up <laughs> yep yep for sure i still think who's this who's the top still i think rc sparks is he still the top i think, I think he's the top so, man he's yeah. the big dog he's the yeah. top. I think he's got over three million view uh subscribers right <laughs> and around for a long time but you yeah. guys are growing good though i mean for a year's time and we gotta say i mean that's you're growing yeah. real good because this look oh, this channels you. that you know you see are around for a few years and mm -hmm. maybe they got a, a thousand subs or two thousand subs and um yeah. you know you, you're doing all right i think what people like about you is that you guys are happy go lucky people i mean and, and we're just looking for some happiness and, for, and some fun and yeah. not exactly. for nothing even the locations where you guys shoot are excellent yeah so <laughs> yeah, we, it's, it's all about having fun at the end of the day yeah. but we do try and mix it up we don't yeah. want to just post the same we don't want to post the same location doing the yeah. same right. kind of stuff just with a different car we want to we like to mix it up and the thing in, about hong kong is there's so many different tracks yeah mostly actually on road a lot of different mm -hmm. on-road tracks and there's some good bashing spots. There are quite a lot of locations. The problem that we have is we live on an island, Lantau Island. And so all of these locations take us roughly two hours to get to. Yeah. So it's a bit of a mission. And Ooh. we don't have a car. We, we're, we're in a private community that only has golf carts. Yeah, you're not allowed so. to have a car. So we don't even have <laughs> yeah. a golf cart because they cost about a million dollars. Yeah, like, <laughs> like on our roads, you won't find cars. You'll find golf carts in the old bus or, or van. <laughs> but we, you know, the, the golf carts are a million of, cost millions millions, millions. <laughs> so we just have to catch a train a, a bus a taxi bus, train, train, sometimes taxi. a boat to get out to these locations to film so it is a mission to get out there sometimes yeah so you're in a golf car for two hours well no no we don't take a golf car we oh. take <laughs> not on the main road oh, would be, okay i was gonna say be a nightmare, I think. <laughs> but it, it's a nightmare just carrying all the stuff and getting on the different trains it's not just one train like you know, the outcast only... taking the outcast yeah the it's a mission man and oh my gosh and it's, it's like a workout yeah. and you got to catch two three trains yeah, yeah. Oh, and peak oh. hour sometimes <laughs> packed the sardines i'm sure you probably know like from your subways sure in there. yeah yep well, I, I even that one beach you were just at recently with one with the WL Toys uh, desert uh, buggy. Disney. Uh, yeah. What a what a nice nice location, man! Right? It was yeah, just beautiful. a beautiful spot, you know. We're lucky because it's just literally five minute walk from yeah. where we live, so we're lucky. Oh, with that. Yeah, that's we're really lucky. nice. Live in a really nice spot. Yeah, <laughs> it's very not cool. like Hong Kong. It's so different. It's very different. Yeah. yeah. Do you miss home? Do you miss New Zealand? Oh yeah, absolutely. We miss it every day, especially oh. this time of year. Yeah, but we can't wait. Like, we to get back, it's just it's impossible because of my roster, my work roster. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. when it comes out, and then we need to have fourteen days quarantine in New Zealand, and then fourteen days quarantine in Hong Kong. So you need twenty eight days to get a few days at home. But then the day that my roster comes out, it's been delayed quite a lot, so it okay. makes it impossible. Yeah. So we have to really wait for the vaccine. Oh yes, okay. Um, yeah. um, and now, Amber, you work too. You work with with yes, your I work as well I work <laughs> for a media company. So okay, I'm super busy as well. And then also, it'd be hard for me to get time off because it's mm. well, I'm uh, I'm full time. So okay, <laughs> yeah. well, I'm full time I too. You are full time, but not at the moment. Not really working a lot. Yeah, because there's a lot of flights. Um, so yeah, it's just a shame. It's pretty bad all around Christmas, but everybody all over the world has experienced this in some way, sure. experiencing oh, yeah. this in just, some way. So so, yeah. yeah. And then how do you find the time to do the RC stuff? And you squeeze it in when you work in full yeah, time. Well, we squeeze it in. Yeah, we, we <laughs> yeah. like sometimes we will literally go film and then I will come home and then I'll eat it and I'll post in the same day. Yeah. Sometimes we'll go out to location, like we might go out to a racetrack and we'll batch film. So we might film like three or four different races. Mm -hmm. You know, we like to mix it up. You know, we're not, we just, we want to show people, you know, don't be shy. You can go out to these tracks that have pros. <laughs> uh, we're, we're obviously very newbie, very beginner drivers. Yeah. 
and you don't have to be afraid or shy just no. get out of there have some fun everybody's you know? so nice here like they're very yeah, welcoming wherever very we welcoming. go um but like we'll and we'll do these different races like we'll do like an, a cheap versus expensive race right uh, i saw that i yeah. see some some people comment they're like you can't do that what are you doing what's the point it's like it's just <laughs> having fun and, yeah. then, and then sometimes we might take monster trucks out to the race tracks but we'll go out and we'll batch for we might do like three videos while we're out there yeah. and then it will come back and then throughout the week I'll, I'll work on them videos and post them yeah but i might not post all three in that week because i don't want to really post three race days in in, in a row <laughs> of course it might yeah. get a little repetitive so i'll, I'll yeah. post like a race day and then the next day might be a bashing video that we might have filmed the two week weeks before, two weeks yeah. ago or something like that but we nice. try and keep it we try and keep it rolling we, we try and keep it different and as entertaining as we can yeah <laughs> it's very cool no I, I loved what you did even when you had the associated going against the wl toys i mean it's, yeah. it's drastic and it's huge too i mean you got hardcore associated guys out there and they would be like oh, yeah. why would you even go there yeah, exactly. we know? had that we had we that did. we had I'm a lot sure. of comments saying why <laughs> like, what yeah. are these guys doing? yeah i think it's good being able to use different here it is RC. right here right it is. Yeah, it is. That's, yeah the that's the one and you did that <laughs> i saw that the other day and i'm like you know but that's what's called the drastic stuff is great i mean that's what yeah. that's what we need to to do but i mean like look at the locations yeah. behind you man it's just awesome yeah, we like to get some you know play. it's yeah. like gosh you know so i mean your thumbnails are awesome everything stands out with you guys you know so you, you're definitely yeah. hitting the nail on the head joe and, does a very good job <laughs> thank you yep yep yeah. And you know what, what I, when I look at your page and I look at your thumbs, everything just screams fun. Wow. And, and what's nice about it is that it's not about, like you said, being experts behind the wheel, you know, yeah. this is, <laughs> exactly. right. I mean, it, definitely are not. <laughs> and, and me too. Like there's times when I smack a wall and I'm like, what, where was I going there? Well, you know, that's, like, that's exactly <laughs> what I asked Amber when she crashed on the beach, like on a beach, she crashes into like a tire. I straight into yep. a it's like both, I think. Like, yeah, into the tire of the trailer. <laughs> you know, there's there's a time where like I um I'll I'll be in a nice open field and there's one tree. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. that's me. And for some reason <laughs> the tree's a magnet and I still hit the tree. I'm like, I got the oldest <laughs> land out here. I'm missing this. Where the hell? How the hell did I hit the tree? You know, so yeah, there's totally bonehead yeah. moves that I do, but that's again, that's what's yeah. like the fun of it. And if you break it, all right, you bring it back to the workshop and we work on exactly, it. And you wrench. Yeah. That's the whole purpose exactly. today, you know. So, and I've had the conversation before, before with other RC guys where, you know, it's good to wrench on things today. Most people are not doing that anymore. Mm -hmm. You know, they're used to creature comforts and getting stuff in right away run it if they break it up don't worry i'll buy another one or yeah, they just yeah. they're afraid to touch and try to wrench on anything exactly yeah. well people are afraid to to push the car you know they might i remember even myself i'm guilty of that when i i remember i got my first sort of really hobby grade rc car it was actually a nitro truggy i might have been like 15 or something and i remember just sort of driving on the street and never taking it off jumps never going to a track right and you know i lost interest in it relatively quickly just because i wasn't going out there and yeah. going out to different locations right. i think that's important is it you, you got your rc car it, i understand why you want to keep it shiny and clean <laughs> but hey just just take it out of there go yeah. find some jumps and change up your location all the time you know one Definitely. weekend you might head out to you know a beach the next weekend you might head out to a racetrack mm -hmm. just change it up yeah yeah totally no and are you guys into drone i see you're into drones as well because you, you have some again one of these days, I know Where? I'm going to see like the, I'm going to see like the Great Wall of China in the behind you. You got to, I promise you, you're going to you see know? that stuff. I mean, that's that's kind of what our goal. I saw one of your questions is what's going to what separates our channel from the rest, right? Because there's right. there's so many, and yeah. you need to find ways to make yourself different or stand out, yeah. right? And so obviously for us, we're not the pros. We're not going to give you guys some <laughs> pro tips on you know, all the ins and outs of the RC and the you know, all the shocks and all that. We'll, we'll give you what we've learned, mm -hmm. but. What we can do is we can take you around the world to different locations. That's the that's the ultimate goal. When the borders open. Yeah. Yeah. So right now, right now we can't. But when we started the channel, we didn't think it was going to take this long. No. But hopefully next year, when the borders start opening up and you know there's vaccine out and we yeah. can start traveling again, I'm I'm working a lot more. I'll be able to take RCs in my bag and go out to these new locations and yeah and film all around the world. Yeah. Because next weekend I mean no next week I'm going to Amsterdam, but I can't take 
I can't go outside my hotel. I'm st- as soon as we land, it's straight to the hotel. Oh, wow. And it's only a short layover, and then it's straight back to Hong Kong. Wow. Whereas if we had the vaccine, when that comes, you yeah. know, we could be going to Amsterdam and then going out and driving around all, all sorts of places. Exactly. You know? Sure. Well, uh, that's a, eventually. It's a nice touch, I'm telling you, because that's, you know, most of the time we're seeing driveway runs or just out in the street. And, you know, yeah. I'm here in New York. I try to find some nice spots here as well. Uh, but it's definitely not as nice as where you guys are. Uh, are you allowed them in Central Park or do you get told you're not allowed them? You know, I probably not. I don't think you can yeah. or can over there. Um, right. So and plus, I'm, you know, I'm about 30, 35 minutes from the George Washington Bridge to head okay. into Manhattan. So and yeah. again, Manhattan's kind of been kind of off limits as of lately you know so uh but we do have some nice spots here in new york but now that it's getting cold and man it's gonna it's gonna be tough to be rcing when it's like you know 20 degrees with wind chill and zero you know plastic's gonna be breaking pretty easily i think we were there in the january it was freezing yeah you know what and my brother right (laughs) hardcore mari guy hardcore mari guy i don't even know if he brought shoes on this trip and i'm not even Uh, kidding you like during the flight I think he slept the whole flight. I think he boarded the flight in socks, got off the flight, still in the socks. And you know what? Middle of winter in New York, didn't bring a jacket, didn't bring a jersey. He's wearing something like this. Oh and we're God. walking around. I'm like, dude, Aren't what, you are you, cold? what are you doing? He's like, he's like, you little bit. <laughs> he's real Mario, you know. <laughs> but eventually we did have to go buy him a jacket. Yeah. 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 It was freezing. It was freezing. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's definitely gets to that point where like I'm, you know, the older I get, the more I hate the cold. So <laughs> it's like the more I want to drive my Volkswagens or get out in RC because it's, you know, I like the heat. My wife's again, she's she's Colombian, so she likes the tropical heat as well. So that's why we're looking to move and go to like we like West Palm Beach, Florida. We like that area. Oh, so nice. if I get there, I'll have some nicer locations to do some more yeah. sea, you know. <laughs> nice. You know, so <laughs> now I see you guys had some favorite uh RCs. I know Amber, you were saying you like the white that white WL toys, but then you yeah. turned, I think, towards the felony. Yeah, uh, I like, um, I think, or as far as budget go, budget cars now, my favorite would probably have to be the 124019. Did <laughs> I get got it right? It. I, never, I never get the numbers right. So, in, in, we do a lot of takes sometimes in our intro sure. and yeah. outro, too. So, oh, we get a lot of practice. No so we get a lot of practice saying these names. But it's just so strange how they use numbers, right? I, I know. Yeah. Yeah. I think, just call it that. <laughs> to be honest, I think they do have names, but I think yeah, we never someone really... explained it to us in a comment. Yeah, they did as well. But, but the, yeah, definitely my favorites budget wise would be the one two four zero one nine yeah um okay. for budget and then i'm gonna have to go with the max i think i always have the most fun with the oh, max the um, Traxxas max okay and i could i backflip that yeah yeah you oh yeah. in a video yeah. you, you did yeah, your first backflip with the max. I, i'm getting pretty yeah. good at the backflips now she is. So. she's getting very good at them. is that yeah. on here with the, oh there you go <laughs> Traxxas max right there yeah there I you think, go um <laughs> is that and that disgusting moustache. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, that- <laughs> oh, come on, you're a pirate. <laughs> no. You know what? My- we were both so skinny there. I <laughs> know. Oh, you know what? My nana, my nana told me off for wearing that T-shirt. <laughs> and so I never wore that T-shirt again, I don't think. Or maybe. <laughs> look how skinny we are. That's hilarious. Oh, I hate when I, tell, I look at old oh, videos of mine from years ago. I look at myself and I'm like, oh, my God, look how much younger I was. Look how much thinner I was. God, <laughs> what are you talking about? This you know, is pre-quarantine, right? <laughs> oh, is this is April, yeah. I went bulking. I went on a bulk. I just haven't stopped yet. <laughs> <laughs> the book of the mountains, though, everything is so nice, you know. Leaving That's the water. where Joe lost his plane in <laughs> that <laughs> reservoir that, right there. The plane is in there somewhere. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah, it's... And then, yeah, I saw this road last time you used. Mm-hmm. That's a good spot. You know, Probably I, the longest stretch of road near we us have close near by us, yeah that's straight yeah i did have the luxury of driving that thing uh my friend vez has that car and uh it's it's very the, the acceleration on it is so smooth and it's just got yeah. a really nice feel to it yeah the slightest little turn and she's yeah. flipping uh i love know. the self-writing feature on it though that's one of my yeah. favorite things i think with the max especially if we go out to mx club or somewhere where you actually physically have to walk quite far to mm-hmm. 
flip a car over. It is. Um, yeah. It's nice if you're lazy like me. <laughs> have you guys picked up the 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 widening kit yet for this car? I know they have an yeah, axle yeah, extension. Yeah, we got the we got the wide kit on, and our, our max is maxed out. We've got all kinds of upgrades on that beast. We've cool. got. Um, We've got a wide kit on it. We've got um, pedal tires currently. At the moment, it's got pedal tires, but we've got all we've got all different oh. tires. We've been making some different videos, testing out different tires. At yeah. the moment, my favorite tires on this Low truck rage? is the uh, not the Road Rage, the Badlands, the three point eight. Uh, yeah, yeah. But the the problem that we did and is we didn't change the gearing, and so we learned that. We learned, we know there was just too much for the gears, and we stripped the spur gear after about ten minutes. So oh, wow. now I've gone ahead and I've lowered the gearing. I've put a lot, you know, small opinion in there, changing that to middle gearing, and now yeah, it seems to be holding up all right so far. Yeah. Very cool. <laughs> yeah, I, I was for my first Traxxas, I was looking to dip into the Max. You know, right. it's definitely I, I really like the. I mean, I almost got an X Max as well because I got the two other big boys. I got the Creighton 8S and the Outcast 8S. So That's a beast, man. That's it beast. would be yeah. nice to do like a Clash of the Titans video. Oh, yeah. And, you know, just just go go ravage with them, you know, yeah. <laughs> um, it's you know, I, I guess I fear, you know, Traxxas says I, when you listen to some of the comments or you read in some of the forums that people are complaining that they break easy. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, the support's there. I can go to my local hobby shop and pick up a Traxxas part. But mm-hmm. many times, you know, if, if they're always breaking that kind of bums me out, you know, um, and, uh, you know, the max as much as I like it. You know, can you wrap your head around the price tag on it? They're a little pricier compared to others in that range. So mm-hmm. would you get a granite instead of the Max or would you get like the the, the TRMT10E, which is from uh, Red Cat? Mm-hmm. You know, they're probably not as structured as yeah. the Max, mm-hmm. you know, but you're saving yourself a good, you know, 150 bucks or so. Um, yeah, well, yeah. well, what we thought was a good competitor was the Red Cat Kaiju. So yes. we got there, and that's 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 three hundred and ninety nine bucks. Right. So it is, you know, more than a hundred dollars cheaper. But I still have to say we definitely prefer the Max over there. Sure. It's just just a bit of quality, yeah. Yeah, nice. I'm looking forward to taking the Outcast out though. We haven't in a long time. We haven't taken the Outcast out for a while. I know. Well, they, you have to plan to those cars. Oh, like, yeah. I, I got to plan them. You know, I got to make sure I start my charging at least, you know, two hours before I'm going to yeah, yeah. go. <laughs> and, you know, I, I have limited trunk space in my car, so I'm not going to love. At least them. you have a car. <laughs> at, least you got a, at least you got a car, man. Come on. We got we to gotta carry these things and we got to so carry. Or, they, that's where these come in. Yeah. We got we gotta, we gotta to carry the cars. We got to carry the remotes. We got to carry all the camera gear. Yeah. We got to carry everything. Yeah. So having a car, you're lucky, man. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, I, I would be afraid to to race you on anything because if I if I beat you, you'd kill me. You'd beat me up. Oh, I'm, I'm coming no. after you. <laughs> come you after you, man. You gotta let me. You gotta let me win if we ever race. Hell, hell yeah. <laughs> You'll come to New York. We won't tell anyone that part. <laughs> so, do you guys got any tips for a newbie or a guy that's looking to get into the hobby? What do you think? Don't um, hold back. That's what I'd say. Yeah. Don't, yeah. Don't hold back. Don't be afraid. Cause I was always way too scared to yeah. kind of break anything right. um, and scared that people would judge me, but Hey, uh, they're going to judge me anyway. Right. Yeah. right. <laughs> just go, go hard. That's yeah. like we were saying before, just get your car. Yeah. Sure. You start off, maybe start off easy and get a feel for the car, you know, yeah. like, Go somewhere nice and easy, not no big jumps. But then, as yeah, you get more right. co- confident with it, just take it out, have For fun, sure. and then you're gonna break something. It's inevitable. Yeah, you're gonna break something. But when you break it, that's when you learn and you can start fixing it. Yeah. And one thing I reckon, and I've seen a few other YouTubers say this, say this is, you don't need to upgrade it right out of the box. You know, right. A lot of people buy a car and then they end up spending hundreds of dollars. For example, the Max, right? The time you buy the middle drive shafts, the wide kit, and all the other accessories you need to get that wide kit working properly, you're almost spending the same price in X-Max, minus the batteries. You know, you're almost wow. spending that price. Sure. So my advice is, you know, when you get your car, just run it stock until you break something. And whatever breaks, then maybe look at upgrading that. I agree. Part. I totally agree. Yeah. And if yeah. you are a newbie, I mean, yeah, don't upgrade right away. See, you know, huh. get your get your feet wet first on the car. <laughs> you know, exactly. yeah, yeah, totally. I see people that just want to dive right in and they have no concept. You know, because these cars are little weapons today. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, they really are. Especially I mean, that felony. I mean, <laughs> yeah, you want to break an ankle, drive the felony into you. You know, yeah. I mean, it's just it, that car is no joke. Exactly. You know, so no, yeah, I totally agree. Now, I mean, 
we so how long ago did you say you started in, in RC, Joe? Well, I started when I was a kid. Yeah. You know, I started when I was a kid, but I didn't go hard out until this year. Like this year, okay. We we started. Emma got me a T-Rex four for Christmas. Yeah. Right. And then I was mm-hmm. like, you know what? Let's. Uh, I've always wanted to be sort of start a YouTube channel. I've got a private my own YouTube channel, just some some gaming videos and maybe <laughs> like a. I think we went on a we did a cruise and we did a bit of a family video. But like with um, I always wanted to do a YouTube start a YouTube yeah. channel and I was like, well, let's unbox this. So we made Don't a watch that no, video. No, no, no. we made a super entertaining <laughs> unboxing of a Terry Four. It's so entertaining. No, you gotta watch it. It's so depressing. You gotta watch it. Depressing. <laughs> Listen to <laughs> it. It's, it's, an, it's an awesome video. It's so embarrassing. And so and that video just took off. Oh. No, not really, it didn't take off. We got about 10 views. And then we were so proud of it. We were proud. <laughs> it blows my mind. I look back at it. I'm I like, can't how, believe we uploaded it. How, how so uh. proud of it. And then the second video, same kind of story. We took it just outside our apartment. And um, yeah. and then, yeah, then we sort of got hooked on this. And then we was like, oh, we need to get, and we, I think we got the, was it the Max next. We got the Max next. We got the Max and next. The, no, we got the WL Toys one. And then we got a bunch of cheapos from like yeah. a mm-hmm. local store. We just got a bunch of cheap RCs and we started yeah. making some fun videos there. And then. So you're oh, talking about, let's see here, if I can find. Oh, oh here we no. go. <laughs> You it know, is. hey, it is right. Oh, there it is. There it is, right? I it can't is. even look. <laughs> but oh, 103 what? people have suffered. I literally think I said two words. You said two words. The ish. whole video. Our intro <laughs> was like, hey, what's up? I'm Joe, and this is. <laughs> it was literally the intro. But amazing, your yeah. third video got close to 10,000 views. Now, I tell so, you what, that third video. That wasn't like that 10,000 views. We went on a what is it? What was that website called? Um, it was like a advertising website, so you pay and they promote your video, yeah. right? Okay, and so I, I did that for this video. I think I put like oh my around maybe $50 or something to, wow. to promote this video because believe it or not, I thought this video was good at the time, and then we got like these views, but we didn't get any watch time, you know, not many people were really watching the video, it was just kind yeah. of like a clip. And all of these videos, we were looking at ourselves instead of the camera. Yeah, we, we, learned, uh-huh. we, learned, we, we learned a lot. But then, and then, it, and then, I, then I didn't do that really again until, um, well, I didn't do it again because then we just started just growing slowly, slowly, mm-hmm. slowly. And then I think the first video that oh, we were really sort of, we we're proud of, we thought, okay, this is not too bad. It was actually a WL Toys 144001 video. It might have okay. been like a 10th. Skate park. I'll tell you right, right now, it was that, that one right there, beneath, yeah, right there. That's Beast no, Chief sorry, RC. no, no, the one down. Here? Yeah, there it you was go. About, it was about that video there, and I was, I was, I was proud of that video, and I thought, you know what? Yeah. Um, yeah, it's, it did all right, you know, it yeah. did all right, and and then and then Look that sort you. of thing started to learn some. I, I was learning. I think it was after this video, I went from, I can't remember what software I was using. I think I was using like HitFilm or something, and then I went to Premiere Pro. Right. And then I started doing a whole bunch of you know, tutorials and lessons online on how to edit better because I just sort of learned it just from watching YouTube videos. Sure. But, yeah, um, I've been with Premiere Pro for a good 20 years. Since 1997, I've been using Premiere wow, Pro because yeah. I've been a yeah. filmmaker for over 20 years. I used to write and direct wow. and do my own independent wow. films. So, awesome. yeah, I did 10 movies all on my own and I, I directed them. I wanted to be Spielberg. I didn't, oh you know, God. this was just a hobby, this stuff. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, you know, but reality starts to set in and that's, that's a, that's a lottery ticket to get in, you know? So yeah. that's why I did the Volkswagen stuff and now I'm doing this. Uh, but you know, your editing skills, right? I mean, just the slow motion and stuff. I mean, that's captivating stuff. Right. So you, you we got look something. So depressing. <laughs> no, 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 no. This video, we still, I still look at it and I still think there are so many things I'll do differently now. Yeah. And I remember getting some advice that someone was saying it's too much slow-mo and I, you know, I, I took on the advice and I learned and, and so then we started to get a little, you know, a little bit better at making videos. And then it wasn't until, it wasn't really until the, we took the Traxxas Max out for its big durability test mm-hmm. video. That was probably when we really started stepping up our, our game, right? And can I just say, I take absolutely no credit for any of the videos. So <laughs> does it all. And he, his editing skills now are incredible. Well, let's, I, let's, I, let's still begin it. Yeah. I think it's, I think it's, it's great. It's, it's more like, thinking it in your head what you want to see and then just watching it loads of tutorials on how to get what you see in your head if you know what i mean sure yeah 
No, it's it's all good, guys. I think you got something special here, and uh, I, I really just it was very enjoyable to speak to you guys. So, if there was anything, say you give you quick top five for the holiday, what cars are you getting for the holiday? Mm. Um, well, I mean, look, we, we we've got some really cool cars coming. Because we've got a top five list that we did recently, but that's all about to change for us yeah. very soon because we've got some big, we've got like three, four big RCs <laughs> coming within the next sort of two know. months. Yeah. Um, and I wish I could say that they were sent to us for free, but no, we brought all the big ones. We only get those, yeah. the cheap ones free. But our top five for the holidays for now, I would still say the Max is number one. The, the Max. Texas Max. So at well. the moment, yeah. Um, Ooh. And then you want to get some cheaper ones in there because you know yeah. not yeah. everyone has yeah. that much money to spend. So yeah. we would suggest the WL Toys one two four zero one nine or yeah. the zero one eight. They're brand new. Yeah. They're, they're fun. They're just sort of just an up update of the that one four four zero zero one, which is also a really cool car. Yeah. Um. So those are some like really good cheap ones around that hundred dollar mark to get. Yep. Get yourself an indoor crawler maybe. You know? Oh yeah, like the SCX twenty four. That's that's a good idea, especially in the cold. You want to stay inside, yeah. mm -hmm. or if you've got a mini Z track nearby, or if you've got a large garage or, or something like that, you yeah. can get some mini Make Z your going. Own track. Then mini Zs are awesome fun. We're just starting to do a bit of mini Z now. Wow! Yeah, so much fun. That's really fun. And um, oh, what's your favorite large scale? Just quickly. Well, we've only got really, we've only got what one large scale. We've well, got the yeah. the Outcast ADS and yeah. the Felony. The Felony, yep. That's yeah, that's pretty large scale. But that's also we got so many, so yeah. many favorites. Uh, my my top five, most of them are armors, you know, because I just I've yeah. been a huge. I mean, I think they've just been cranking it. You oh, know, they have and, and putting oh, out yeah. such such incredible stuff. I mean, the other companies are you know drip drip effect. They're putting out some cars, and sometimes yeah. they put out a new generation, and it's just a slightly mm -hmm. different from the previous. But yeah, armor yeah. seems yeah. to be just you know pounding it out there and oh yeah and getting it you know. So I'm actually going to be doing like a top. Uh, 10 2020 list with my uh, good friend okay. Hallie from 10 scale garage today I'm going to be on a conference with him and we're going to be breaking down our different lists and kind of see you know what you think was the best for 2020 so awesome. but yeah WL Toys is definitely up there I mean it's such a hot car yeah for, yeah. for the cheap you know, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you one that we've got on the way is the Creighton XB so we're looking forward oh. to that because we don't yeah. have a Creighton no, we don't. So that's going to be fun. Yeah. I got the Creighton yeah. 8S, eight eight the big one. Like the, I like the yeah. Outcast. And, Is it good? Uh, it's an awesome truck. I mean, it's so yeah. tough to say which the, the two different personalities, the Outcast and the Creighton. Yeah. Um, you know, the Outcast is just going to wheelie a lot more. It's a shorter wheelbase. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. But the Creighton is, you want nice level Cadillac driving and going off jumps <laughs> and that thing just sailing. You get the Creighton. I mean, it's just, it is a beast. It had a couple setbacks in the beginning, but, you know, nothing to the point to, to really deter it. So, yeah. but uh, guys, what's the best way people can contact you? Um, via, e well, via email, the RCKiwis at gmail.com okay. or through our Instagram, Instagram, Instagram DMs yeah. or Facebook um, DMs. You know, we're not, we're not, we're not flooded. Yeah. It's we're still we're relatively just, small, so we'll, we'll reply to you, of yeah, course. Yeah, we're just at the RC Kiwis on Instagram and the RC Kiwis on Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Simple as that. <laughs> well, I'm looking forward to more of your videos. I get the notifications. I've signed up, so, uh, you know, uh, it, it would be great awesome. to come back with you, and maybe next time, you know, we could break down a car or something. And, well, just, mate, and Maybe next time we'll be in New York and we'll be able to meet up Hell for a yeah. race. Absolutely. And you're going to let me win. Come on <laughs> over, come to the shop. My mom's all Sicilian. She'll make some food for us. Oh, and we'll, go. we'll you, you've some, got us at food. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you guys, have kept, I got cappuccino here. We can do it all up, man. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Good that stuff. sounds like a plan. Well, it's great having you guys on the show. And uh, I really hope to see you in the future. And uh, let's definitely keep in touch. Absolutely. Thank awesome. you so Thanks much so for much, having Chris. us. Oh, you're very welcome, guys. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Yes. All right, see Merry you Christmas. Too. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. Thank you.